Hello, I'm Jauma. Hello, I'm Dean. And in this video, we are going to talk about Panasonic PTZ cameras. Uh, these cameras can be controlled over IP. And a typical question from customers is how to set up the configuration for these cameras. Yeah, it's a very popular question. Um, customers are using IP more and more every single day. And now we have lots of different offerings from Panasonic. Firstly, we have our hardware, our new remote operation panels, which we already use for our studio cameras. But what we can now do in the latest firmware update is use them with our PTZ cameras, our UB300 box camera, and even our Vericam. And that gives us complete control over a network to easily fit them into a production environment and rack mount them, for example. This is uh, mainly for studio applications, right? But I think also we have a new software based solutions for many more customers, right? We do. So one of the biggest requests from customers was uh, using a Windows based software remote operation panel similar to this. And what we have new is our new software ROP. Mm -hmm. The software ROP means that we connect our PC to the network, which our cameras are sitting on, and we can see up to 16 on one page and easily access them. And what's also great about the software ROP is we have an easy IP where we can configure our cameras, set the IP addresses and port numbers easily, which customers are already familiar with, embedded within the remote operation panel. And it works great with all different kind of Windows-based systems as well, so there's no heavy requirements. A nice function about this uh, software ROP is the preset control, right? Exactly. So once we have our cameras already set up using Easy IP, we can then access the cameras, and we can use, similar to the web interface, our camera controller. We can use uh, the iris control, pan tilt functions that you would expect, but mm -hmm. easily over the network. And we also have our presets. So we have nine preset windows and it saves the still image from the camera. So we know which position we want to load into, which is a new feature. This software can do the same as the app for the iPad for the control assist camera, right? So from the app store on the iPad, we have the PTZ control app. And what that means is we have the PTZ and the HA10 combined and we can tap the motion image outputting from the HEA10 and move the PTZ. And now we have that function in the Windows-based version in software ROP. So we can see the live image from the PTZ and we can see the HEA10 motion image, meaning customers can just click and the camera moves easily into the position they want live. And this uh, function is also possible without the HEA10, right? Correct. So this is a new, really exciting feature, is that the camera, we can set a 180 degree position. So we can start from here and it takes a still image every time. And what that means is we have a still image as a reference point. So we can click wherever we want to and the camera will move. So perfect for education, conferencing, broadcasters as well. And the nice thing about the software ROP is we can have multiple users uh, using the ROP with different administration levels. It sounds exciting. I think uh, customers can save a lot of time with this software. So we should invite everybody to test this new software which is compatible with uh, the current lineup of PTZ cameras. Absolutely. So thanks for watching and see you in the next video. See you in the next video.